We are just hours away from a scheduled vote in the House Judiciary Committee on whether to hold Attorney General William Barr in contempt over his refusal to release an unredacted version of the Mueller report and other evidence, including grand jury material. Meanwhile, there seems to be at least a rhetorical split between Barr and his FBI director over whether the government spied on the Trump presidential campaign. Chief Intelligence Correspondent Catherine Herod shows us tonight. Thank you for your presence here. During a routine budget hearing, a Senate Democrat asked a wide-ranging question about FBI tactics, with the director avoiding the same spying language as his boss, the attorney general. That's not the term I would use. I would say that's a no. I believe that the FBI is engaged in investigative activity, and part of investigative activity includes surveillance activity. Last month, Barr said spying occurred on the Trump campaign, questioning whether it was based on credible intelligence, leading to political pushback and a media frenzy. Last week, Barr stood by his choice of language. I think spying is a good English word that, in fact, doesn't have synonyms because it is the broadest word uh, in incorporating really all forms of covert intelligence collections. During the 2016 campaign, the FBI secured a surveillance warrant for a Trump campaign aide Carter Page, which allows for communications collection well beyond the original target. When pressed, Director Ray answered carefully, citing the ongoing inspector general investigation into alleged surveillance abuse during the 2016 campaign. Do you have any evidence that any illegal surveillance into the campaigns or individuals associated with the campaigns by the FBI occurred? I don't think I personally have any evidence of that sort. As tensions between the Justice Department and the Democrat-led House Judiciary Committee escalate over access to the full special counsel report and underlying records, a senior Democrat shot back after the Senate Majority Leader said the Dems can't let go. It's finally over. What we've seen is a meltdown. An absolute meltdown. Mitch McConnell is aiding and abetting it by refusing to do anything. It may be that Trump wants the Russians to participate, and he's telling McConnell to do nothing. The Democrat-led House Judiciary Committee is poised to vote Wednesday morning to hold Barr in contempt because the Justice Department has not provided the entire Mueller report, including grand jury material, which would require a court order. DOJ officials told reporters they continue to engage with committee staff, adding House Democrats impose, quote, unreasonable terms on the attorney general, Brett. Catherine, thank you. You're welcome.